Hello guys, you're welcome to the channel. My name is Yawa Simpi Zetre and this is Ashko TV, the official YouTube channel for Aceda House Commodities. Remember, Aceda House Commodities is a mass trading entity. Now we have taken our time over the past decade, yes, the past 10 years to study about the maize market and the maize trading trends in Ghana. And should you be a poultry farmer, should you be animal feed producer, fish feed producers, you know, They've been calling in recent times fish feed producers. If, you, if you're a fish feed producer or a fish farmer, okay, and you need maize for your production. If you're a beer production company, you need maize, clean maize. I'll show you some maize, some stocks that we have, fantastic stocks. I'll show you um, the moisture content, the cleanliness of such maize, and then you will know for yourself. If you are in the industry, you will know quality maize when you see it. Now, should you need maize, like I was saying, for your production, we are the best people to speak with. No matter the numbers that you need, pick up our numbers or get in touch with us and let's get you, you know, the goods that you need. Right. For today's video, I know it has been a while, right, that we have met and it's because of the work, work, work. We've been working so, so, so hard and it's all for the good, just so that we can get practical information whenever we, are, we hit your screens right now like we are doing right now all right so if you have been following my videos for the past one month the topic i have been preaching is about trading maize and the fact that this is the time for planting and even if you and for yeah for the trading aspect the fact that this is the time that you can stock as much maize as possible and in today's video, I'm going to give you some guidelines. I'm going to enlighten them, you know, as I have spoken about them before, but I want to enlighten and talk deep about them and emphasize on the importance of, you know, following those steps so that you can get your maze to the right time, sell, make your profit, and most importantly, say the good stories about, about maze trading. All right. So, you know, we are in February, and February is the time that you should, by February, we are today is 7th, 7th February, and from now, anytime from now to the end of February, if you want to go into maize trading, you want to stock some maize and sell when the price is better, this is when you should buy. Other than that, this information is for future, it's, it, it's for you know the seasons to come for you, right? And why am I saying this in February? There is a bumper harvest for the second crop. Now, let me give you some few characteristics of the second crop, the second maize crop for that matter. For the second crop, what is locally known as a rear brew, what happened is that whenever it is harvested, the time for it to harvest, to be harvested, is the hammer time period. You know, we are in hammer time, right? And what happens is that it is able to dry with the natural sun. This maize is able to dry with the natural sun. What that also means is that it is most of the times very free from animal infestation. Com if you compare it to the major season, you realize that this, this crop, this second crop, or this, this second season crop has high resistance rate to, you know, pest and animal infestation. Okay. And like I was saying, it is also because it has used, the sun is able to dry it very well. You get a very high moisture. In, you get the best moisture content. Okay. You can get up to 10% moisture content which is far, 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 far better than even the, the standard. All right. So when you get this kind of stocks, you are able to store it for a very long time. Okay. To a, for a very long time. Remember also that the cash out period for this crop is around June, May, June. Okay. By 15th of June, you should have sold it because that is when what I call the, the cash out period. That is when prices are very, very high for this crop. Okay, so this second crop that I'm talking about, 
the area bro that I'm talking about, you don't need to send it to any maze drying machine, any maze drying center for it to be dried right after harvest, right after you've bought it from the, the maize farmers, you can go ahead and store it if you don't want to sell it outright. If you're not a flipping type of maize trader, if you want to hold and sell later, you can do that right away. Okay, now the good thing is if you, you don't have access to these maize farmers, that is why we are here as Ashko. Okay, we always have stocks. Like you can see, what you're seeing is second crop maize, you know, that we've covered. It just arrived yesterday. This is second crop maize. All right. Yes, so you see, this is maize. All right. So we are here. We are, we are coming to rebag it into 50 kg. And if you want some, there's a lot coming. This is just, you know, something small. There's a lot coming that we are buying from the farmers. If you want some in large quantities, pick up anamis, call us, buy it now. Store it and sell it when the prices are better. This is the, this is the coolest investment, agribusiness in investments anybody can, you know, introduce to you. Okay? The best agribusiness investment opportunity anybody can, you know, recommend to you. All right. So that is it for if you are not able to go to the farms, to, to the farmers to buy yourself, we are going to give you, we are going to, you know, supply to you or sell to you at a very, a very, you know, um, good price. We are going to give you a very good deal. All right. So, like I was saying, and continuing the, you know, the topic. Don't let us meet in March when prices begin to rise and you see, you hear, you begin to hear good stories about those who have stock maize and then you begin to ask questions. Ask for me, if you ask me the questions, I'll answer you right. I'll give you, your, I'll give you all the information you need. But at that time, it, will, it would have been too late for you to store, for you to buy. Because if you compare the price at that time, somewhere in March, in March, April, it wouldn't make sense you know, a lot of sense, a lot of business sense. Okay, so let's say if it is right now, if a, a, a bag is 220 CDs, 220, 230 CDs, all right, for the 50 kg. And if you wait until April, where it is somewhere 300 CDs, you understand where it is 300 CDs. Let's say we are we are anticipating that by by May June, which is the cash the cash out period, it will be 400 CDs or 350 CDs. If, it is, if, if that's the case, if you buy it now at 250 CDs, when you sell it then, you're making a cool 100, 100 CDs. But if you wait until it is March, April, it means your profit is going down. Okay, so the earlier, the better. I'll always bring you the information and it is up to you to make use of it. All right, like I say, the, one of the main reasons why I keep doing this is I want as many African youth to say good stories about agribusiness. It's very important to me, and it's very important to, you know, we at Ashko. All right. So that is it for it. Um, like, you, like, like you've seen already that I've said about this second crop, or this second season crop, it is very resistant to, you know, animal infestation. It is very, you don't need to send it to any, any dryer, any drying machine, any drying center for it to be dried. You can just buy it from the farmers you can, and just store it right away. Or you can buy from us and store right away and be sure and be assured that this crop is going to be there for a very long time. Okay. You can store it for a very long time and then sell it whenever you want to sell. Okay. All right. So that is it for this, for today's video. Remember, it is never too late to go into agribusiness. It is never too early to go into agribusiness. No matter how old you are, there is no time, age limit 
in making money, in doing business, especially in agribusiness, where you don't have to use physical strength. You only have to do what? Use, do your investments wisely. All right. Place your money where you should place it. Place your money where you get a lot of benefits from it and make a lot of social impact. Because believe you me, whenever you go into agribusiness, what you do, what you don't know is that you are helping to create employment for a lot of African youth as much as possible. You are helping to grow the economy. Okay. So this and a lot more reasons are is why you should go into agribusiness anytime you get a chance. All right. Until you meet in the next one. The summary of this vi of of today's video is that we are in February. If you want to store maize, this is the best time to store it. And the maize that you are going to get to store now is of high quality and which means that it is going to be there for a very long time, for as much time that you will need to keep it to be able to sell and make much more profit than you would have done at any other time. And that means it's also very resistant to animal infestation and it is also, the moisture content is also very, very, very good. All right. Thank you for watching today's video. Click on the like button, click comment, leave your comment, share this video, share the link, please. Share it is very important. Let others also get to hear this information. It's very important. Until we meet in the next one, remember, my name is Yawa Simpi Sechere, and as always, this is Ashko TV, the official YouTube channel for Aceda House Commodities and your most proactive agribusiness channel here on YouTube. Until we meet in the next one, it's bye-bye for now.